Welcome to the Wisdom Mastermind. Today, we'll be solving a problem from two perspectives, a Zen monk and a Stoic philosopher. And today, the question is, how do I cope with the constant fear of failure? This is a common struggle many of us face, a fear that can paralyze our ambitions and keep us stuck in a cycle of self-doubt. It's like a shadow, always lurking behind us, whispering doubts and anxieties. The quote by Epictetus suggests that instead of hoping for a certain outcome, we should accept whatever happens. This begs the question, how can we truly accept failure and still strive for success? Tell me, what do you think of this problem and how each of you would approach this question? Friend, fear of failure is a natural instinct a consequence of our desire for security and control. But, as Marcus Aurelius reminds us, the only true control we have is over our thoughts and actions. Our fear stems from the illusion that we can predict and dictate the future, but we can only influence the present. Remember, as Seneca said, we suffer more often in imagination than in reality. If we embrace this idea, we can focus on the process of our endeavors, not the outcome. The fear of failure then becomes a catalyst for growth. We can learn from our missteps, refine our approaches, and ultimately find strength in our resilience. It is not about avoiding failure, but about accepting it as an inevitable part of the journey towards success. Friend, the fear of failure is a heavy burden to carry a constant reminder of our perceived imperfection. It is rooted in attachment to a desired outcome, clinging to the illusion of control. True freedom lies in letting go of expectations and embracing the present moment. Just as the flowing water adapts to the riverbed, we must learn to adapt to the ebb and flow of life. The Buddhist concept of impermanence reminds us that nothing is permanent including our successes and failures. By accepting this truth, we can find peace and release from the grip of fear. Instead of fearing failure, we can view it as a valuable opportunity for learning and growth, a chance to refine our path and discover new possibilities. Let go of the need for control, friend, and allow yourself to be guided by the wisdom of the present moment. Like, share, and subscribe for more daily wisdom. Thank you. Stoistica.